Today, river parks reopened and cities like New Braunfels have already seen groups gathering along the Comal River. And while that's a good sign for the economy, businesses and city leaders say they're taking precautions. The night team Stephen Cavazos breaks down the new changes and what this means for that community. Uh, America's back to work. We're going tubing. Sammy Morrell and his friend came down to New Braunfels from Dallas. Morrell says he was recently furloughed from his job and has spent the majority of his time at home. But today, some fun in the sun. I think it's beneficial for everyone's mental health. I think sitting in a house all day, you know, it's not good. River parks around the state open to the public again, the first time in over a month. We are trying our best to tr bring back some sense of normalcy. New Braunfels Mayor Baron Castile says Prince Psalms Park, Hidman Island and the city's tube chute are open, but with restrictions. Park hours have been limited and social distancing must still be maintained, but crowds still seem congregating in certain areas. Mayor Castile says people should be following the guidelines set in place. We've got to do it in a way that that avoids that one on one contact, gives us the ability to provide some guidance, but at the same time comply with the governor's order. As groups get back here to the river for some fun in the sun, another group that's ready to get back to everyday life are businesses right here along the Comal River. Texas Tube has been operating along the Comal River for more than 20 years, but this is the first. They had to be closed during a busy season. Owner and operator Coley Reno says the closure was financially devastating for him and his staff. It just felt good to be here to see people out. Reno says he and other river outfitters worked with city leaders to determine the best way to continue operations. Tubes are disinfected and only used once a day. He says it's a new way of life along the river. When you do open up, these are some protocols we need to have. Stephen Cavasso's KSAT 12 News. River parks will be open from 9 a.m. to 8 p.m. each day. More parks along the Guadalupe River are expected to open tomorrow. Today,